CPU Galaxy. Welcome to the first chip rating on the CPU Galaxy channel. Today with a very special and beautiful CPU from the 70s, the Intel 8080 and for our rating the C8080A in a white 40-pin ceramic package and a gold lid. The Intel 8080 was released in April 1974 and with its 6000 transistors and a clock speed of 2 MHz you can call it a predecessor of the famous x86 technology. The 8080 was successful enough that translation compatibility at the assembly language level became a design requirement for the Intel 8086 and led to the 8080 directly influencing all later variants of the x86 architectures. The 8080 was a 8-bit CPU and manufactured in NMOS technology and could run the operating system CPM. One of the most famous microcomputers which used the CPU was the Altair 8800. And now let's move to the rating. From the historical point of view this CPU deserves definitely 5 points because at this point in time those kind of CPUs made computing at home possible in a decent price range and led at the end to those nice vintage PCs we like so much. Technical also 5 points, cause in terms of concept and technology you can call this chip the great grandfather of x86 CPUs. In terms of rarity I will give here 3 points, the CPU in white ceramic and in good condition is harder and harder to find. Sometimes they appear on eBay but never in high quantities. For the value I would rate the CPU in perfect condition up to 250 US dollar, but a fair deal would be 150. Scratched, desoldered or ones with missing pins around 50 US dollar. For the look I have to give here also 4 points. White ceramic and the gold lid is just too beautiful and for all collectors always the preferred package. And we have no reason for an extra point. So we have here then a rating of 19, which brings this CPU into the upper range of very collectible. And indeed, it is a very beautiful CPU with a great history. If you have it already in your collection, congratulations. If you are still searching for one, it will be harder and harder to get this for cheap and nearly impossible to find it in an old computer at a scrapyard. So that was it for today. In the description you can find a link to a spreadsheet where all ratings are recorded I published so far. Thank you very much for watching, don't forget to subscribe and see you next time.